With all of the duties in the star path, many of us are looking for ways to do them faster, more efficiently, or find different kinds of workarounds. Now you probably know we have this for things like gathering certain colors of flowers that you can drop them and pick them up again, and that counts. If you didn't, there's a tip for you. But did you know something similar works for the shells? In the latest star path in Disney Dreamlight Valley, we need to collect a lot of shells as part of one of the star path duties. Now when I ran across my entire beach, I got 11 of them and this wasn't quite enough so I'd have to wait for them to respawn. But if I don't want to do that, I can actually drop them and pick them up again. This doesn't work exactly the same way as the flower trick because with the flowers when you drop them, say you drop 10 of them, you're going to see 10 individual flowers. And for most items that stack, this dropping and picking up trick doesn't work so I didn't really expect it to but you know I had to try. And so it does work for the shells, it's just easier. Each time you pick something up, it's only going to count as one. So if you have a stack of six in your pocket, you want to separate it into six individual stacks and then pick them up so that you can get all six shells to count. Now it does seem like maybe when you pick up a stack, sometimes it counts, sometimes it seemed like it didn't, but definitely if you drop just one shell and pick it up again, it seems to count towards the star path duty and can give you a workaround if you're waiting for them to respawn and just want to get this out of the way to see is there another time lock duty behind this. So hopefully this makes completing your star path duties just a little bit easier.